What's up, everybody? It's been a while since I've made one of these videos, and this one's going to be kind of a long one. Um, I wanted to talk about something that's been super important to me and something that's been extremely significant to my career, which is producing, producing media, and what is important when it comes to producing media. There is quite a few different approaches and different strategies that one can take when it comes to producing and obviously there are many different tiers and now producing has many different buckets and categories and there's such a varied form of producing. There's audio producing, media producing, AR producing, video producing, you know, there's uh, so sound engineering producing, there's live event producing, there's e-game producing, there's every single possible kind of producing, right? But when it comes to producing, your ultimate goals and the overlying um, approach and underlying principles tend to overlap no matter what it is that you're doing. So. This typically the approach which has always been important, which is that you take whatever your project is and you make sure that you deliver it on time and under budget. Those are the goals. Make sure that you use the time that you have effectively. Make sure that you use the money that you have effectively and ideally optimally so that you spend less than you have to spend and you make more money and then whoever it is that has, whether it's yourself or someone else that has hired you to produce that job, then is very happy because there's more profit. That's the project management side of producing and then depending on the project, there's actually many different strategies that you can take. But what I want to talk about today is whether, because as long as I've been producing, there's, there's always been that component of things that, that, that's, that's been important, you know, taking the project and making sure that it's successful and delivering it within time frame and under budget. But what I've recently come to think about, which, is, which has kind of changed my approach, which is something that I want all of you other producers to weigh in on, is whether producing is actually less about the project and more about the people that get you to produce that project. Um, it's a lot more about thinking of your project as a either a component of a business or the business itself and understanding that your production is actually a vehicle to create business relationships because a project-based um, Work, a project-based approach to overall producing is going to leave you constantly focused on pro on more projects and trying to get and trying to get it's trying to go from one project to another project and win another project and that's going to be your entire focus. What do you do when you don't have projects? You're going to be looking. You're going to be pitching. You're going to be hunting. You're going to be not producing. So you want to produce in a way where you are optimizing your your approach. You're strategizing for the client, for the people you work with building the effect of the right team and delivering the right output, but all the while not just maintaining, but actually building relationships that are gonna then compound and then bring you new work, more work, better talent, um, and more partnerships and collaborations. But you could potentially ask the question that maybe one is in conflict with the other, does, I don't know, what do you guys think? Is taking a collaborative relationship building type approach to producing in conflict with trying to be an efficient streamlined project manager? What do you guys think?